Australia at the moment, a lot of the states here have been quarantined. Honestly, I really like watching people that are going through the same thing as me. So I thought today I would do a video that I think a lot of other Australians can relate to right now being in quarantine. I've literally been waking up, getting out of bed and going to online school. It hasn't been setting me up right. So this week I've decided I'm going to get up every single day at 7am. I'm going to go to bed earlier as a consequence. And then I go for my run as you will have seen. I have also been trying to wear some more normal clothes and it's really been helping. So this isn't like the cutest outfit. I just have this pink little top and then I just have these like kind of flare leggings but it's comfy and then i've just put my wet hair in one of these so that it can dry so school starts in literally like one minute so i'm just gonna make my bed quickly and then we'll get to online school i realized that i'm late to my class i'm three minutes late but the class doesn't seem to have started and my internet's not really working so we're thriving Hello. I should have said for me to have a, an undefined point on our, um, our function. Well. The thing is, when you're looking at your curves, is you just think cross your hands and all to represent that. Everyone's lining up to see her. There must be something about her features. You'll find her in the ghost of Steve. Once you get to meet her. You see her walking down the boulevard. Thank you. She got the posture of a superstar. So I've just finished double maths for the morning. That was a bit of a struggle. I was reasonably productive. Um, I'm so glad at my school we have a break halfway between classes, and because this one was a double, so I had the break halfway through math. So good because I don't think I would have gotten through it otherwise. Maths is just one of those subjects that it's hard to do online. So now I have my recess break and I'm gonna go make some food. And I actually have an interview for captain at lunch. So I'm also going to just prepare some documents for that. So I have just decided to come outside into my backyard to eat my apple. And as you can hear, someone's decided to mow their lawn. So I just figure, don't really come outside anymore and it's actually a pretty nice day so i'm gonna sit out here enjoy this beautiful noise and eat my apple so i've looked through my notes for my interview and i think i'm pretty much ready so i'm not really gonna do anything for that and i've been outside basically i just wanted to say that like this is a vlog of me getting myself back together because i know if I saw this vlog a week ago, I would have felt pretty bad about myself, and but this is the same person a week later, and so I mean, lockdown, it's hard, it's annoying, particularly like this is our sixth lockdown, so whilst I think that getting up early has definitely made me feel better today, it's lockdown, don't be too harsh on yourself. I just wanted to say that, and... I'm just eating some peanuts. So, I think I've decided that I'm just going to practice my French speech because I have a speech tomorrow and I have not learnt it. And not only is it a um, speech, but it's a speech in another language that I'm not very good at and then I'll probably just sit on my phone for another 10 minutes until class starts again because I'm not gonna lie, halfway through maths I definitely spent 10 minutes stalking some of my friends on social media for no reason. Bonjour maman et papa, comment vous savez le lycée au fond? Lycée au fond, on a fait chaud, on prend son temps à la fin de cette année. Peut-être vrai à l'heure où Oh, 
Yes, I am very bad at speaking French. Please don't judge me. Thank you. And that was me speaking, literally reading the thing, and I have to go off my hopper by tomorrow. I actually should probably check what class I have. Hopefully it's not French. Actually, maybe French would be good because then I have time to practice. My guess is chemistry. And I have English. So I have an English essay tomorrow, so kind of glad that I have English because I could do it with some practice. Scout law and all that. Yeah. Can you spot Mike Wazowski? I'm about to cry. I'm just like in class and I got an email to say that I got a job interview. And yes, we are in lockdown. This is for a Christmas casual interview. So I'm so excited! I can't believe I got an interview. Honestly, don't have the job yet. But getting an interview is pretty cool. I've noticed a lot of people have dogs. Plans for their dogs. Like, the Melbourne Young Mum. Exploring the idea that a topic and it connected to you. Okay, so the explanation bit, not just what they do, so it's not just summary. Is this not the most relatable thing of quarantining? So, I'm not gonna lie, I just had English and we went into like breakout rooms if we wanted to, to study. And I was gonna study, but I ended up talking with my friends for the entire hour. I feel really bad about myself because I just wasted an hour and I'm really stressed at the moment. I'm gonna go make myself lunch and then I'm gonna sit down and do half an hour of work because I basically just had my lunch break by sitting with my friend. Banging that butt metal bar and repeating that associate. It's got worse. I'll break it down and then we're gonna have a good So it's the end of the day, I have my retainer in and honestly I'm not feeling amazing. I've just been doing some homework but I'm just going to have an early night and maybe get up early tomorrow and do some homework. We'll see. But that is it for today's vlog. I hope you enjoyed it and I will see you in another one. Thank <laughs> you.